Hey guys, today we are going to check out two gaming chairs. This is the new TT Racing Max and this is the Victorage Hurricane. They look very similar, but trust me, they are very different. Let's check it out. Since I've previously already done a review of the Victor Rage Hurricane, let me quickly show you around the new TT Racing Max. So this chair is the latest release from TT Racing. It's clear that this is their attempt at a premium gaming chair because this is also their most expensive model. The Max comes in a gold or black accent finishing, but this gold really looks amazing. It's also got this two material finishing where you have your usual fault leather and this thing they call plush velour. It's definitely a cool look, but only time will tell how that plush velour will last. Besides that, you'll also get the lumbar and neck pillow, which I find to be a bit too soft. The armrests are fully adjustable in all directions as you would expect from any gaming chair at this price point. I do really like the fact that the front and back adjustments can be locked. The Victorage doesn't have this locking mechanism and I've accidentally moved it forward and backward a few times before. Lastly, the wheels can be locked. Yes, for some reason, if you want to really stick yourself into one location, you can lock the wheels. Oh, there's also this gap between the backrest and the seat. I'm not sure if that's intentional or not, but things can fall through this. Overall, I think that the build quality is good. It's definitely better than the entry models which I've seen people break a few times before. Now let's compare it to the Victorage Hurricane. While transporting both of the chairs to my apartment, I realized that my fingers could more prominently feel the steel frame inside the Max compared to the Hurricane. And that's just by squeezing this part. With just a light squeeze, I can easily feel the frame of the Max. For the Hurricane, I could not really feel the frame unless I applied more pressure. It's very clear that the foam density and quality is much better in the Hurricane. So you think that the Max will have a very soft, pillow-like seating experience compared to the Hurricane, right? Well, you're wrong. I'm not sure how Victorage does it, but sitting on the Hurricane, you feel very comfortable and supported. And when I move to the Max, I kid you not, it's rock solid. I'm not sure how I can demonstrate this, but compared to the Hurricane, this feels like a rock. It's so hard that's what she said now i believe that there are people who prefer a much firmer chair but it's not for me the hurricane just has the right amount of support without being too soft that's what she said <laughs> to give tt racing the benefit of the doubt this is a very very new chair so the foam might be very stiff at this moment and maybe over time it'll soften up. I don't know, I'm just sharing my personal experience. Now here's a quick non-scientific shake test. Notice the difference in sound that each chair makes. Let's compare how both these chairs recline. Firstly, there's a big difference in the handle design. The Hurricane is designed better whilst the Max is a bit bare looking. For the pricing of above 1000 ringgit, I'd expect the Max to have a better handle. Secondly, both of them can recline up to 155 degrees but because of the better foam on the Hurricane, it's more comfortable to fully recline on it compared to the Max. Lastly are the wheels. I'm very particular about good quality and smooth wheels especially after my terrible experience with the Thomas Cyrix. That chair required me to do a leg workout in order to move it. Anyway, thankfully, the wheels for the TT Racing Max is good. However, the Victor Rage Hurricane is just much better. Let me show you with just the push of a finger. It doesn't seem like much, but for something that you're going to be using every day, you want to be gliding on the floor instead of fighting with the chair. Oh wait, there's one more difference in regards to rocking the chair. With the Hurricane, it's good and smooth. However, on the Max, there's a grinding feeling on the base when I rock the chair. It's 
quite annoying and honestly it would really put me off from considering this chair because I really like rocking the chair especially when I'm thinking and this constant grinding feeling is just very distracting. So let's wrap it up. If you'd ask me, I'd definitely go for the Victorage Hurricane. The price difference at the end of the day is only between 250 to 300 ringgit depending on the sales and promotions at your time of viewing the chairs. Since you're already in the 1000 ringgit pricing range, why not just spend a couple hundred more for what I think is a better and more comfortable gaming chair. This is going to be something that you're going to be sitting on every day for long hours so it's worth investing in the better chair and not just simply go for the cheaper option. It's also worth noting that the Max only comes with 2 years warranty whilst the Hurricane comes with 6 years of warranty. So that's it for this video. I really hope that I've helped you guys make a more informed decision for your next gaming chair. Links to both the chairs will be in the description box below and if you have any questions, just drop me a comment. See you guys for the next video. Bye!